Hello guys and welcome back to my channel. Today I will be reviewing my Avengers Endgame Funko Pops. As you can see, hopefully, I don't have a lot as of right now. Um, there are quite a few that are missing from the original line that I don't have. Like, I don't have the Hulk, Ant-Man, Nebula, Black Widow, or Captain Marvel. And I don't have the original Captain America, but I do have the Hot Topic exclusive. And I have the 6 inch Hulk. But as far as the exclusives go, I have like three from the line. But I'll start with my first one, which is War Machine here. I got this one first because I don't have a war machine. I don't really have, I think I have one Iron Man. No, I have two Iron Man pops, but I'll get to those in a later one. Um, but I did love this war machine just because he wasn't in the suit. And I know a lot of people aren't fans of the Avengers being in their, their suits. And a lot of people want them back in their, like, their armors and, like, just regular costumes. But I did get this Tony Stark because I have two Iron Man Funko Pops, but I don't have a Tony Stark with just him, like, without the suit. So I figured I'd grab him. Um, this Funko Pop is pretty cool. I do like the little watch here. But, I don't know. I'm not a big fan of the suits myself. Like, I wish they would just have their regular costumes, like, from the movie. But, it's, it's not a big deal. Now, the next one from the line is Thor. And I love that he, they did put Stormbreaker in with him, and they just didn't have him in a suit or whatever. But, I kind of want... I really... I don't kind of want... I really want the FYE exclusive of Thor with him with Stormbreaker and Mjolnir, but unfortunately we don't have an FYE anymore around us. They closed the one down in the neighboring city, so if I had to go to an FYE I had to travel a bit, and right now I just don't feel like traveling, but that's the end game exclusive Thor. I apologize if it's hard to tell, but I will try to show them as best as I can. And then next we have Thanos. Now, I didn't really have any Thanos Funko Pops, and I really love this one. I think this is the best one from the original line, just because he's got so much detail in his armor. And it's just, it's an amazing pop. And I don't know if you'll be able to really see it, but there's the weapon from the movie. I'm trying to show it as best I can. I apologize. I will get better lighting someday. Now, this Hawkeye, like, second from Thanos, this is my favorite one. Like, I love that Hawkeye has, like, a different suit and that he kind of has his Ronin suit on, which, as you can tell, is basically the same suit. Like I said, I will try to get better lighting when I'm trying to show it there. Sorry about the glare. Um, I would take them out of the box, but I'm very particular about having my pops in boxes just because I took a couple out. Like, my first Funko Pop ever, I got about six years ago? Six or six? It's been it's been a long time, and I didn't keep the boxes, and I regret it ever since. But there's the Ronin Walmart Funko Pop. I'm trying to get him into focus here. I'm trying to show off the suit, but it's kind of like from where I'm sta standing, like I can't really see much on the camera. I know when I did my earlier video of my furry bones it did show better on 
the video, but I still kind of want to make sure that y'all are able to see it. And next we have the Walmart exclusive rocket. Now this is my first rocket pop. Unfortunately, I didn't get one of the Guardians of the Galaxy rocket pops, but when I saw this one, I had to get it. Um, I actually went to the neighboring town to find this one, and thankfully I found him and Ronan at the same one, so I picked them both up. But I do love Rocket. Rocket's one of my favorite characters from Guardians of the Galaxy. In the movies, at least. But I guess he's, he's one of my favorite ones from the um, comic books, too. But... And then, like I said, I have the Hot Topic exclusive Captain America, as you can hopefully see there. Now, this one I picked up rather than getting the Captain America from the original line. Because, like I said, it, he had the original, you know, his Captain America suit on. And I do really like that. Trying to show him better there. And of course he has his helmets and stuff. I really wish he had the shield with this, but unfortunately he doesn't. Um, and then next we have the, hey baby, the six inch Hulk. I hope you can see him there. Um, he does have the uh, Iron Man version of the Infinity Gauntlet. I'm trying to see if you can see him. Well, there's a bunch of glare. But like I said, I will get better lighting one day, hopefully soon. But I'm trying to get him close up. There's the, there's the side view of okay, him. That way, y'all can get somewhat of a better idea of what he looks like in the box. And if I ever take these out, I will do a video, but right now I don't think I'll ever take them out of the box. Just because I have taken Funko Pops out of the box before. And have regretted it. But there is the line, the original line. And it also has the three extended which has the Hulk right there and then there's Thor and Rescue I almost got Rescue and I kinda wish I did but there you have it that is my collection of the in-game Funko Pops and hopefully I will add more and once I get them in I will do an update video um... I did pick up a Funko Pop today Unfortunately, it's not from the Avengers line, but my Walmart, where I got my SD card and everything for the camera, had a Lion King display, and I ended up picking up Mufasa. I hope that you can see him there. I just kind of want to show off my, my new Funko Pop. I haven't really been collecting as of late because I am saving up for a trip. I saw Mufasa and I had to get him. I have been wanting a Lion King pop for a while now. And Walmart always has a good deal on pops. I mean, most of their pops are $8.98 or something like that for each pop. And that's a really good price. So I went ahead and just pick up, picked up Mufasa. And someone had to put him on top of the display. Um, like I said, I don't really plan on taking my pops out of the box. And I don't really plan on selling a lot of them, so I'm not really worried about, like, the, uh, damage on them. I mean, it's minor damage, but I'm not too worried about it. I do love Lion King, and since I don't really collect a bunch of Disney pops, I'll go ahead and take him out and show him. He is a really good sized pop, being, like the king and everything, but there he is. That way y'all can get to see an actual pop out of the box and see what it looks like. 
I do love his tail here. I feel like it's about to break. <laughs> but there you have it. There's Mufasa. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. And thanks for watching.